What is happening everyone? I hope y'all are doing well fantastic and I'm finally back after not uploading for a month. Good job, Bill. But hold on, hold on, hold on. Before you say anything, I got an excuse. I basically we first first thing okay first things first uh i've been moving houses basically the past two weeks and stuff and yeah so far i've got everything you know in my room you know my tv my gaming setup and everything it's just looking fine all right so that's why i'm ready to you know make some videos and stuff and yeah i should be good to go i guess from now on and no more leaving the channel for a month obviously and the second reason for that is because uh, obviously we got no news whatsoever and yeah it was just boring, you know what I mean? And there was nothing to discuss. And if I were to be discussing stuff, it would just be, you know, just predictions and stuff, which no one really likes nowadays because eh, most of the predictions are, you know, not true, I guess. But anyway, we will be discussing what's there today. I, on the other hand, like my previous videos have just been predictions, but this video, I'm just going to be discussing what's there, I guess. I, so anyway, without any further ado, let's begin. So uh, first things first, we got uh, two events in uh in june right and this is why i'm really like i wanted to make this video i just really got like motivated and hyped you know to make this video just to inform y'all what's going to be taking place in june and why you should tune in for june all right so first of all we got e3 everyone knows e3 you know good old you know announcements and stuff you know good old you know hypes and stuff you know they're going to be taking place obviously this is going to be online to make it safer i guess that's what i heard at least that e3 is going to be online and they're going to be announcing a lot of games as usual but but, 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 hold on. Before you say anything, we got another event on June 10th. And the reason why I'm going to discuss about this event is because it's very, very interesting. I right. so y'all know how Resident Evil 8 got announced and stuff, and then we got the game and stuff, and it was a good game, but it wasn't the best and stuff. And that's all we got, basically. We didn't get any good games in 2021. It was just a boring year, right? And I've discussed in my previous videos that, holy shit, how are they going to pull this up? Oh my god, 2022 seems to be an option for God of War Ragnarok. Well, guess what? I don't think that's the case anymore. Yes, guys, that's right. You heard me right. I don't think it's going to be coming out in 2022. I think that this game, plus Horizon Zero Dawn, they're going to, both of them are just going to come out in 2021. And let me convince y'all, all right? There's going to be an event on June 10th. Alright, 20 to 30 games are going to be announced, okay? And guess who's attending this fucking event? None other than Sony. Yes, Sony is going to be attending this event. And uh, 20 to 30 games are going to be announced, and yeah. I just really thought you guys should know this, because it makes sense for them to announce, you know, most of the games that are going to be coming out. Let me explain why, alright? So you know how Sony has been silent, they've been making these shitty ass fucking state of plays here and there where they announce fuck all and like no one really benefited them, benefited from those videos, yeah, that's right. So now, this is their opportunity to attend this gaming fest, I don't know, game fest, and surprise everyone, I Hopefully, this is where God of War Ragnarok is going to be announced. Horizon Zero Dawn, hopefully, is going to be announced as well. And Dying Light 2, I'm hoping that's going to be announced at E3 since it makes the most sense, but the point being is that a lot of good games, a lot of good shit are going to be announced at that date. And you know you know how it's, this event is taking place two days before E3? That just makes even more sense for them to announce you know, the best games which are going to be coming out this year. And we're hopefully with no delays and stuff. And yeah, as I said, hopefully everything goes as planned. You know, my previous videos I said, oh yeah, the game's gonna come out. These games are going to be coming out in 2022 and shit. But yeah, that doesn't seem to be the case anymore. And we'll find out on June 12th, or June 10th, sorry, not 12th. 12th is going to be E3, and Sony's not going to be attending that. However, June 10th, they're going to be attending that event. And 20 to 30 games are going to be announced. Hopefully, God of War Ragnarok will be announced as planned, 2021. Hopefully, around November or December. And Horizon should be announced, you know, maybe November as well. I'd say maybe November or... Yeah, I, I guess November as well. November is a good date for that uh, game to come out. Uh, that game to come out. Sorry about that. Anyway, <clears throat> so that's about it for this video. I just wanted to let y'all know that there are two events that are going to be happening, plus a couple of boxing matches, which I'm excited for, by the way. Not to mention, I mean, we got Logan Paul versus Floyd Mayweather, which is an eh fight because we all know how that's gonna end. And we've got Austin McGroom, McBroom versus Bryce Hall and Taylor Holder versus Gibb and Deji versus Vinny Hacker, which is going to be an amazing event so yeah and June that's my point basically the reason why I wanted to make this video is because of you know how insane of a month June is gonna be you know what I mean so yeah 
Anyway guys, uh, this has been it for this video. I hope y'all enjoyed this and uh, yeah, if you did, leave a like, uh, subscribe, you know, if you want more content since I will be uploading, you know, from now on consistently and you know, I'll be uploading every once every three or two days or something like that and uh, yeah, that's about it. And don't worry about me leaving for a month, that won't be happening again, it was a one-time thing, uh, yeah. Anyway, that's about it. Uh, thank y'all for watching and yeah, peace.